Hello, welcome to another video. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing. This unboxing is from DP Clubs. They did send me these items for review, so thank you to DP Clubs. So let's move the stuff aside here. I know I had a, yes, I had a diamond painting pen. So this diamond painting pen, if I could get it out because it doesn't seem to want me to get it out. <laughs> This is $2.99 and it's this really pretty blue here. So it does have a six placer and a single placer. The single placer is really hard to get out here. But it does have this really, it's really pretty, I like it. And it's not too heavy, which is my number one criteria for pens not too heavy and not too ch fat because I have small hands so I think this this fits the bill I might this might be yeah I might end up liking this one so this one is did I say it's two dollars and a 99 cents on the website all right next thing this one is six dollars and 79 cents and it's a pencil case I think I might just cut it instead of trying to take off the plastic. So it's actually in a Ziploc bag here. So it's a pencil case here. It does have two openings here. And you know, if the plastic wasn't one big piece of plastic, these should be two separate containers here. So some flowers. Here, it looks like it's going to be a mixture of regular size drills and specials. So ordinary toolkit. And let's look at the special. So this, did I say this is $6.79 and it's about 21 by 7 by about two and a half centimeters. And it should, yeah. It should be able to fit a pen, right? Yep, it fits the pen here. So it looks like some teardrops, some marquees, some more teardrops, and then some bigger drills here. And then these are the regular size drills here. So I foresee myself finishing this before the end of the video because this will probably take me 30 minutes. My my prediction. You know what? I'm going to keep this in here because I like putting my spare, my leftovers back into the bag. All right. There it is. That one. And next diamond painting here. This one is a partial special shape one. This one is should be a 30 by 40 and it's $5.79 on the website. Ordinary toolkit. So it does look like it's special drills. And it's this here. It says Happy Hollow Thanksmas. So I guess it's supposed to be a mixture of Halloween, Thanksgiving, and Christmas. So there is a cat with a pumpkin here. And then this cat looks like it has a Santa hat. And I'm trying to find the Thanksgiving part. Which part is Thanksgiving? Is it because there's a leaf here? Maybe. This leaf. And then this cat has a scarf on. So maybe, yeah, these leaves are the... And then there's a coffee right here. <laughs> Nothing says fall like having what that pumpkin spice latte you know and if I bought I, um, if I bought coffee and then didn't drink it black I might try out the pumpkin spice one but I did get um, pumpkin spice flavored cookies from Trader Joe's it's okay it's like a supposed to be a 
Oreo type thing, except it tastes too much to me. Like it tastes like graham crackers from what I remember. I can't remember. And I just ate it. <laughs> I ate one last night. So it looks like it has 16 colors, mostly letters. I'm hoping these will be obvious because they don't have any symbols. It's just, you're going to have to base it off of color, which marquee to put on there. And here is it close up. So I thought this was this was an interesting one. I could get all my I could just keep this up for a long time, right? Although it looks more Halloween than it does Thanksgiving or Christmas. So here is the some regular drill um regular white drills and then some rhinestones. And then some more rhinestones here. Oh, these are different. Um, this is, it looks black, but it has a silver coating on top. So that's a little different. And then some brown, some marquees here. Some gold ones, some big round ones. And some more marquees here. So yeah, I think I've never... I, <laughs> I bet you I kept this down. I'm like, oh yeah, I did get something like this. I do so many specials that I'm not surprised when I'm like, I when I kept down and I have like a bag ready for everything. So here is this one. Did I say this is five dollars and seventy nine cents? I probably did. So next one is. Why can I find it? This one is six dollars and 99 cents it's a 30 by 40 regular round drill one the drills don't want to leave the bag there so like i said these are regular round drills with Ordinary Toolkit. And here it is. It's this silhouette of a girl swinging with, I guess, a sunset here. And I don't know if these are butterflies or just um, leaves, different color leaves. Yeah, no, no, they're, they're leaves. I'm looking at the original picture, which, you know, I actually have with me because I've been trying to, I've been actually making my journal entry as I get them. So, so at the time, this was $5.79 when I had made, when I had, when originally choosing, but now I see it's $6.99. So that was back when I made choices in the beginning of September. So there you go. So all the prices I'm talking about is at the time of me recording this video, which is October 1. So the prices might change, but they should be a ballpark figure. Oh yeah. This is a 24 by 33. But yeah, I used to just make my journal entry as I went along, and then now I'm like, you know what? I'll just print it. I'll just print my picture directly onto my journal page, and then print my information directly onto my journal page. And it does take a little bit more effort for me, but I figure it it'll work out. I'll be I'll start getting really efficient at doing it. So here are the colors. That's really pretty orange here. And some pinks, browns, blues, more browns, yellows, and oranges here. Some, this is a really pretty red here. And then some more yellow. Yeah, I do notice that these more silhouette diamond paintings turn out pictures turn out really good as diamond paintings probably because it's a simple image and 
it's easier to get the definition. All right. So this next one, this one is actually a bigger one. It's $13.99 at the time of me recording this video. And it's a 30 by 70. It's a, it's a, it's a tall skinny one. So ordinary toolkit. Looks like the drills are in these like 200 pack um, baggies. So if you haven't gotten one of these, each of these bags should have about 200 drills. And it's long. It's, it's like those lanterns here. It's a long one, like I said, a long lantern with I'm thinking it's cats here. So here's the image from the website here. It's that image there. So let's see, it's a 62 by 22 and a half and there's 23 colors all the symbols look like they're letters here and drill field drill field i think looks pretty decent at least the D and the O are completely different colors, so you shouldn't be able to accidentally mix them up. I, I, yeah. There you go. And not taking the drills out of here, but I am going to write down the part number, which I see right here. V2. 436 just to make sure later on when I'm putting this all back together because I do store my drills separately than my canvas that I'll be able to find the drills I have yet to completely lose anything so I think I'm doing a good enough job with my organization so the next diamond painting here, man, I, I, I cut, I, when I was making my journal, journal entries, I, I have the mushroom punch, so I've just been finding them. You know how like when you open a hole puncher and you're trying to slowly throw away things? It's never, it's never, it doesn't ever work well without having all those things right next to you. Right, this last one, this one is a 40 by 40. It's $13.79. And this is a square drill diamond painting. So slightly different toolkit here. It does have a large amount of wax, some silver tweezers, a pen with a blue squishy with a four placer. And then I think this is the nine placer here. And the drills are in baggies here. And here it is. It's these rain boots with flowers. And if you've been following my channel, you might remember seeing this picture before, but as a round. My mom actually completed that picture. But since, you know, my mom was the one who did it, and I really liked the picture, and I saw this as a square, I, I was like, you know what, sometime in the future, because it's not going to be soon, sorry, I'm, I want to do this picture. I, I think it's, it's a really nice, it's a really nice picture with the rain boots. I'm trying to find it on my journal. 
here it is. So yeah, here's the original image here. And this is 1379. And like I said, it's a square. It's about 38 and a half by 38, almost 39. And this has 40 colors, which I really, really like. I'm a big fan of a lot of colors, but not too many. There's a point when you only have, when, when the quantity of drills you need is like two. Is it worth that extra color? Maybe. <laughs> so the symbols are primarily symbols, and there's a couple letters spattered in there. And like I said, these are squares, and if you haven't done squares before, you may not realize that the symbols are actually smaller in squares than they are in rounds because squares are 2.5 millimeters wide while rounds are 2.8 millimeters wide. So for the same size picture, um, the squares will actually have more, more drills in the same size picture. So that's why sometimes you might notice a little bit more definition in a square just because there's just more drills per square centimeter. All right, and here's the drills. No, I am not going to, it does have the part number in there. I'm not gonna show you all the drills here. All right, that is the last one I'm unboxing. I actually had a, quite a few in this one, so I'm gonna move you up. You'll see my mouse and then my pile of trays here. So here's that one. Here is the pencil case. Here is a pen. Here is the picture with the lantern. Wow, that it is much narrower when you have it right next to this one. Here's the picture of the girl swinging. Here's the, I'm gonna move, put it upside on the bottom. Here's the hollow, happy hollow thanks miss. And I think that's everything. All right, so I'm gonna work on probably the two partials and have those finishes at the end of the video and I'll see you later. Okay, I'm back and the pencil case is done here. So I did already seal these. So it does have two compartments here. And I've been using these to store my diamond painting stuff when I'm going away. Like I would put, well, you know, if I'm not at home, I put a pen in here and then over here I usually put wax. Although I haven't been using wax recently, I've been using double-sided adhesive, but the double-sided adhesive is a little bit more difficult to take with me. Hmm, I probably could just put it in a... make a smaller roll of double-sided adhesive. But, yeah, here it is. Uh, what did I write? So the box is about 27 by, 21 by 7 centimeters. There was nine colors, three crystal rhinestones, and six specials. Um, I did add some extra dr drills, and this took me 17 minutes to complete. <clears throat> My main thing is there is a lot of excess glue. I'm not sure if you could tell from the camera, but yeah, you can see the excess glue here. I have already sealed this. <clears throat> I have already sealed this, but you can see see the excess glue. And I think it's just because with this plastic, maybe it's not as, the glue isn't as gluey. It's almost like I kind of wish that they would just put the glue on the whole thing or something, and then I will just seal it and you might not see the, the pools of glue. But, eh. As long as you're, if you're looking at it from this far away, you can't tell. But I think this is, it's cute. Like I said, I did add extra drills. I think like lots of them were these green ones. I think some of them only had a drill on a couple of them. And then I was just like, um, maybe I should add another one. Maybe I should have added one to there. But I thought maybe it was too close to the edge. Oh, and maybe one here. But, but yeah, here it is. It's, 
<clears throat> Man, my voice is going away for whatever reason. <clears throat> I think it's just too early in the morning. <laughs> All right, let me move you up. So the next one I finished is this one here. It says, Happy Hollow Thanks Miss. So this one is a 24 by 34 with 16 colors, two are regular round drills, eight crystal rhinestones, and six specials. I did replace some of the white with CR1. I don't know what that means. <clears throat> oh, I'm like, what in the world am I talking about? Crystal rhinestone one. <laughs> I, I got fancy and then I was like, what did I mean? You know, you know how you write things and you think, oh, future me is going to know exactly what I was talking about. Nope, future me did not remember until like, I was like, oh, okay. Um, this took me one hour and eight minutes to complete. So I think the ones that I, I replaced, oops, there's random white drill there. I think the one that I replaced with the crystal rhinestones are these ones here. The, I don't remember anymore. Oh, extra drills. Okay. You know, I actually have no idea what I replaced. <laughs> it hasn't even been that long since I record when since I diamond painted this, but I went through a a mass specials marathon and this one was one of the earlier ones that I did. So yeah, I did replace some stuff with the white crystal rhinestones. I could see myself doing that. You know what? How I would figure that out is what was actually in this diamond painting. Yeah. I think I replaced a, some of these ones were, and this one was just regular white drills because I don't see white crystal rhinestones in here. So yeah, like I said, <laughs> I don't even remember half of what I do anymore. So I think it's cute. I mean, it's a special. It's very partial. And you can kind of tell what things are. This one, this cat, unfortunately, I don't know what happened to the cat, but is it like a half? Is it like a scary cat? I think it was just weirdly rendered. Like the cat is gray over here, but brown over here. So, yeah, I'm not sure what happened to that cat there, but this cat's not bad. And then the jack-o'-lantern and that cat there is fine. So, yeah, there is this one here. So that's the two finishes for this unboxing. So here is all the finishes. So thank you to DP Clubs for sending these items and the other items for review. And thank you very much for watching and happy diamond painting. Bye.